Hello, I'm back, and today, where are we? Here we are. I'll be making uh, this soldier. I'll be casting it in uh, Delphi, and I'll be using the casting rings. So, I'll get on with it, and I'll join back in a minute. Right, so I'm back. I've compacted the clay, not too hard with a hammer, because I want to be able to push the soldier in to at least the depth of his uh, gun tip. So I'm going to get on with that. So a bit of talc, just do that off the table and scrape that round again to keep the the other side of the clay from sticking. Give it a good blow, get off the excess and uh, fit the top. Alright, so top's on. I'll go ahead and I'll fill that with some more. couple of wax to compact it. It's best to get the, the top compact as much as you can. The tighter you get it, the better. I usually just push down as well because it's hard to whack in the corner, the sides, the clay builds up. Apart. You've got to do it gentle as you can. Difficult, I've got some clay caught down the side here. So it's uh, resisting. So there's the two pieces of trash down here. I need to refill that. But it's alright. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut again and get that out Ooh. without smashing the camera. So there's both sides. As you can see I've still got to repair that. I'm gonna do that now. What I'll just do is uh, lay the soldier back in, like so. Oh, not even filming. 
so like that and then I'll just uh, chuck a bit more in and compact it down again and then I'll come back right so I've repaired the bottom down there and now I need to put the pore hole in so I'm going to do it just here down the back push it through it'll come out here then I'll cut a funnel and I'll switch you off for of that as well but I'll turn you back on when it's finished alright so I've got the pore hole in now big funnel here I'll pour in there the hole through it's clear just got to make sure there's no there's nothing in there blocking any of the and then just put it back together and that is it and we're ready uh, there's a failed soldier I don't think I'm gonna be able to make that one it should have two legs coming down there and there's gonna be too much work needed after so I'm not gonna go with that one so that's in the melting pot and I've got some here from a previous cast just get off some of the crap that was on it Pour that in. Uh, that's it now. Heat. Pour. And I'll I'll get heating and then I'll switch you back on. Which is near the end of its gas, so it takes a little longer to heat than normal. So we're already there at molten. in hopefully say hopefully uh, where are we just here looks like the molds pretty much full dip it in the bath I could have done more cleaning that to be honest I'm just looking here and uh, I haven't shut the mould completely level, so I don't believe it. Yeah, well, considering I haven't shut the mould properly, <coughs> I look like I've got away with that. I've leaked out here, which is the only place, luckily. Uh, I'll shut you off, get you in a better position. Ah, 
might have dropped it in the water. I'll get the clippers. It's the spray off. Let's check this out. So here it is, there's the soldier, not too bad, it's turned out quite good considering I didn't close the mould properly, got a little bit here to cut off, uh, a little sand and that'll look great, so I'm pleased with that, I'll, I'll come back with it a bit later on and show you. So here we are, finished soldier. Oh, let me put the scales on first. So it's 0.4 of an ounce. And tumbled and filed down in places. Let's see if I can zoom a bit better. It's not showing it too well. That's it complete. Right, there we go. I'll leave you with that image and the weight. And that's me out.